So you've probably got the Echo Show and you are wondering, can I watch YouTube? Can I watch Netflix? And can I use Google? Hey everybody, this is Aiden from Everyday Tech. Before we get going, if you could subscribe to my channel just below, that would be great. And if you do enjoy this, then please give me a like and a thumbs up and help spread this video worldwide. So you've got the Echo Show and you are like, well, how useful is it? Is it a tablet? Is it just a screen? What can I do with it? Can I still watch programs? Can I still search? Well, yes and no. You can do most things and some things you can do, but not well. But let's take a look. So let's start with number one, and that is YouTube. Can you watch YouTube on the Echo Show? Well, the short answer is yes, you can. You can search for videos straight from the home screen. You can say to it, open YouTube. I'm gonna mute her because she's just gonna search for things. I don't know that. Sir, open YouTube. And she will open YouTube. You can even say from the outset, Sir, show me tech videos on YouTube. And she will show you tech videos on YouTube. But it isn't with without a few little issues. And the biggest one for me, let's say you're watching a load of funny videos. When you come to play that video, it doesn't automatically fill the screen. You have to enlarge it yourself. That's fine. But what does frustrate me ever so slightly is that when it does come to the end of that video, it will automatically play the next one, but the screen reverts to going back in the top left hand corner which is quite annoying, but it's not the end of the world. The fact that you are still able to watch YouTube videos is still a bonus. So number two is Google. Can you use Google? Well, the short answer is yes, you can. Now it isn't perfect. It isn't perfect by a long shot, but you can still use as a search engine using Google. It can be a little frustrating because you have to open Google first before you start searching. So you can't just say, like on YouTube, you can just say straight away, search YouTube for X, Y, Z. I can't say search Google for X, Y, Z because it'll just search for X, Y, Z, but not in Google. You have to open Google first and then you can say search for X, Y, Z. So just bear that in mind, but you can still use it as a full web browser. You can still use it like you would on a, think of it like a tablet, but it has the benefit being used with, this is kind of what we would like to see, the integration of Google with a, that would be ideal. It's not really gonna happen. This is just a work around, but it is kind of useful. So yes, you can use Google and it is quite good. Now, the other thing to bear in mind is you have two web browsers to choose from. You have Silk, which is Amazon's own web browser and you have Firefox. So I do recommend using Silk as your browser and Google as your search engine. And you can use Firefox as your browser, but if you use Firefox and Google together on the Echo Show, the setup isn't quite as nice, not as intuitive, and for me, it's it just has a slightly better feel using Silk than Firefox. And number three, can you watch Netflix? Well, so you can use Google to get onto Netflix's own site. You can sign in with your icon and everything, and everything will come up like it does on your tablet brilliant you can then press play and this is where it all falls apart when you press play it will ask you to download the app now you can log into your google play store and your google account but when you it asks you to pick a device and it doesn't recognize this device as a device you can download it to which is a real pain so you actually can't watch Netflix on this device. 
but maybe in the future. So if you've not got an Echo Show, then don't be put off. You can still use it. It's still a limited tablet, but a good viewing experience. The sound is great. It's great for music. I watch a lot of Amazon Prime stuff when I'm in the kitchen, and I still watch YouTube videos on it. You know, funny prank videos, something to kill the time. It's ideal for that. It's still good if you've got security cameras or the ring doorbell. Don't forget, it's made for these things as well. You can still do your shopping. There are lots of things it can still do very well. So, if you've enjoyed this video, guys, don't forget, give me a like. And if you've really enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And guys, I shall see you soon. Bye.